Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a brand new video, obviously, and today I'm so excited to share with you some brand new goodies from NYX. So NYX, I went to a NYX event um, about a couple of days ago. I'm not sure how long it's gonna be before I get this video up, but anyway, a couple of nights ago, I got invited to go to a NYX event, basically for the launch of their new product. So basically, they've got some brand new products they're releasing very shortly, and I'm so excited to, that I get to share them with you. So basically, let's just get right on into it. And if there's any like swatch videos or first impression videos, demos, reviews, that kind of thing that you want to see more of, please let me know in the comments below. I'd be more than happy to do that for you. And I'll have all the information about all the products that I showed to you today in the description box below. So check that out if you're interested. Started. So the first product that I'm so excited about is this eyeshadow palette. It is gigantic. Um, so let's open this baby up. I've already had a look at it. Yeah, we've had a little sneak sneak. I haven't used it yet, but oh my gosh, it is it is huge. It's got so many colours. And whoa, I'm gonna break it. Here's all the colours here. So this is like a rainbow arrangement. Like it is just so beautiful. It's got matte and shimmer, so you're good to go there. And then if you slide it to the side here, you also get some bronzers, some highlighters, some blushes real intense blush if you want to go all out and also some like lip um, lipsticks as well so that's awesome like it's a palette full of everything um, so I'm really excited about that great sturdy quality S sticks shut really well I can't get my words out today but anyway that's awesome I'll have the link below for that I think it's going to retail for like $39 or something um, so the next pack that I have here is this baby and these are all about your base so I'm all about the base if you know me the base of your face is just everything when it comes to makeup. So you've got your finishing um, mist spray, so it sets your makeup in place, holds it in place all day. I actually did try this and it is just amazing. It's just, you can feel it setting your makeup. It's not heavy at all. It's actually quite refreshing at the start and then it just dries and you don't feel anything. It keeps your makeup staying put. It's really awesome. And then this primer, I cannot rave enough about this primer as well. It's a very um, sort of smoothing finish, similar to the professional. Um, I've heard a lot of people say, and I have to agree, um, it's really mattifying and it conceals like you wouldn't believe. It is so good. And then this is the finishing powder. I haven't tried this yet, but I'm really excited about that. Um, I haven't had much experience with finishing powders, powders to be honest, so I'm going to have to um, play around with that and practice, I think. So that's really cool. I'm really excited about that. And the next pack I have here, this will be a really good like little Christmas gift um, coming up into that time of year. Um, it's like creeping up so quickly. So in this, I'm really sorry about the lights, like glaring it out. So basically you have, what do we have in here? A mini size of the finishing spray and all over balm, you have a flush contour duo um, little du uh, single there. The smaller like travel size, I suppose you could say, of the finishing powder that I just showed. And then a NYX Butter Gloss, a Liquid Illuminator, and a Pore Filler. So this pack is so good. Even for like a, beginner's, um, a beginner pack, if you know someone that's just getting into makeup or you just want something travel size that you can just take with you, you've got all the little things that you need that you want to take, then this would be ideal. And of course, if you want me to do like a first impressions wearing these, trying them on, swatching and all that kind of stuff, please let me know and I'll be happy to do a video on that as well. And now uh, we've got two mascaras. This one is called the Curvaceous Lash um, So basically here is your wand Super nice and straight gets in there with all those little lashes and then the next mascara that I'm so excited about This one I swear is just made for me. I don't have like the biggest lashes or anything They're quite sparse like I'm not wearing falsies or anything at the moment. So they just hardly they just yeah, I need more lashes. So this is awesome for people like me. Um, the mascara wand is so thin. I will show you it here. So this is like perfect for, whoa, it's the other way. Perfect for bottom lashes. Or if you have a hard time like finding those little ones in here, I find it hard, especially in here, to find them. Um, and just because they're short, I mean, this will really lengthen and get in there and get every single lash. So love this awesome invention. I haven't seen another mascara like that. Okay, and then on to the next product. This is interesting. It's called NYX Vamped Up Alumuse. It's a top coat. So this is interesting. I'm not really sure. So it's a twisty one. Lip top coat. 
thick top coat protector. Interesting. It's black. Not really. Don't really understand that concept. I'm gonna have to look into that. Yeah, weird. Weird one. But if you're into black lips, then this is probably for you. Okay, the next product that I have, which is on my lips right now, it is so bright and intense. And I love my pink lipsticks. Like anyone who knows me knows that. And this is a NYX Liquid Suede. So there's a whole range of colors in this collection I'm so excited about. They feel so good. Like they're not the real drying out matte lipstick. So you don't have to worry about that. And this is in the color Pink Lust slash Passion Rose. So it's a beautiful bright pink. Like it's crazy. And the applicator is like nice doe foot really easy to apply and the next products i have here are the nyx butter glosses so we've got some new butter glosses and then you have the intense butter gloss so slightly different these are more like nudie browns and these are all like your more nudie light pinks and stuff so um, i also have this odd one that i um i have singly that's not in a pack so this one i'll start with is called cherry cheesecake and it's a really bright intense orange and I'm so excited to do like a swatch video of these so that's it there nice and creamy and sheer and I'll open these ones up and do a quick swatch of these on my hand but if you want to see them like on the lips and how they wear um, then yeah I will do that as well in another video so okay let's get these babies out oh, okay this one is called apple strudel and it's this is coming up more pale than it actually is, but in comparison to the orange, it's much lighter, as you can see. And then we have this next shade, which is a more like lighter nudie, more nudie pink, I suppose, and it's called Eclair Eclair. So let's have a look at that one. Oh, this is a beautiful, more like light baby pink. Oh my gosh, my lighting's gone so weird with the sun. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go, hopefully you can see that there and then this one is like a bright red i love this cherry pie it's called and you can't go wrong with a classic red like a cherry red it's so like glossy and creamy ah so pretty so they're the four there that i have so that's these new butter glosses okay and then now i'll move on to the intense butter glosses so i'm excited to see the shades of these so let's open them up I'll swatch on the other hand. <laughs> okay, so I only have three of these. And the first shade we have here is like a coral pink and it's called Sorbet. And it looks like this. It's a beautiful peach color. There. And then the next shade I'll go from, I'll save the darkest till last. This one is more of like a brownie nude. And so this one's called Tress. Leech it, leeches. Oh my gosh, I can't speak whatever language that is. Okay, so this is a brownie nude, like a beautiful, like Kylie Jenner sort of nude lip color. That was a really messy swatch. swatch. Sorry about that. I'm just getting it everywhere. And then the last one we have is a deep, deep brown, and this is called Chocolate Crepe. And this would be really fun to wear, I think. Oh my gosh, look at that. I'm just going to just paint my hand with it so pretty i love that so in comparison if you've i don't know if you can notice but the intense butter butter glosses seem to be less glossy and more creamy whereas the normal butter glosses just seem to have that nice sheen about them with like like a really pigmented gloss i would say and then these are more of like a creamy gloss they're still glossy but not as much so yeah that's everything that's in my nyx haul my new releases from nyx i'm so excited um, so yeah, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new to my channel. I'll have lots more videos like this coming up very shortly. And if you have any requests, please leave them down below. I'm more than happy to share the goods with you. So yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye. So the buttercloth shade that was actually in this pack is called Cream Brulee. And I'll just show you this one. Oh, that's a really light, salmon-y, like pinky nude color. All right, let's have a look at this liquid illuminator. So, subtle but really pretty. I can see the shimmer. Like if you wore this, or like on your cheekbones or wherever you want to highlight your face, it wouldn't look too like glittery or anything. It's like really subtle.
but it's just the most beautiful, subtle, like, sheen. Like, it's just really pretty. The blush and contour duo. So that's that there. I just swatch like this. And have a better look. That. Just do like a swatch down my arm there. You can see that. Yeah, that's really cool. I think I'll have lots of fun playing with that um, on my face. Has anybody else used this? It's, what is this? Ooh, look at that. It's like clear. It doesn't really have a scent, but it's real creamy. I would say this would be like for your lips or like you want to have a bit of a, um, you know, highlight on your face or if you need moisture anywhere on your body or on your face, and this would be really cool. So cute and compact, it'd be really good for like your handbag or makeup bag. Finishing spray. That has a really nice smell about it actually. I really like that. Everybody needs a little bit of pore filler in their life, unless you're like a supermodel. Let's see. I'm running out of swatch space. Okay, my hand. So this is a like um, you know, a skin colour, a light skin colour. And it just, it, yeah, it's so mattifying and smooth. Love it. 